what is up, risk takers? Welcome to the Kill Pete Strategy. I am Pete. I'm a top player in Risk Global Domination. I have a daily release on YouTube. I'm doing weeknight streams on Twitch. And if you are interested in getting better at the game of Risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channels. Come along the ride with me, folks. I'm doing some meta settings. I'm doing some meta settings with alliances. Let's see if anyone else wants to ally up. Yeah, I'll take the red alliance. Give me some info. I got I got the noob corner spawn here, I think. Yeah, no one goes inside of me. I'm gonna put on the two in London. And control the noob corner turn one. See if anyone else wants to work with me. Okay, so do you see all the capitals to start? Starting with Pete in London. Things white. Uh, we see magenta in Istanbul. We see blue in North Africa. In a corner cap. We see green in Africa. Why would blue put back there? Is it's because they're dumb. Is there a noob? Okay. Green is here. Yes. They're going to put their entire spawn behind me. Yeah, you have a seven stack. Okay, you have a six stack in the pocket. Okay, purple wants to be homies. They're going to see what I'm up to. Yep. Yeah, blue is super dumb. Also, blue now steps off capital. Okay, so blue's terrible. Blue's going to get themselves killed pretty quick. We see magenta, we see blue, we see green, we see myself. We see purple in Finland. And we see red in Russia. Okay, so those are the six capitals, folks. Okay, magenta aggressively taking Orient, turn one. That blue capital is very bad, yes. Hey, Amp, how you doing, buddy? So the guys that went after me in the turn order wanted to ally up. The, the other guys earlier did not, so. I mean, I'm gonna have to hit that stack, aren't I? So Monkey Man doesn't get the bread idea. Let's <laughs> keep putting troops back there, right, guys? <laughs> Sorry, Monkey Man. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Monkey Man. Didn't mean to fuck up your shit. <laughs> it's my corner. That's it's my corner. <laughs> I've been on this corner for 15 years. Man, green doesn't have anything on their capital either. I think green and blue might be the same person because they're playing the same kind of bad. Oh, man. Not too shabby. Got you on both monitors right now. Fuck yeah. Because you're editing the Pete, man. Car Carved Epitaph says, so it's come to this. I'm finally watching your stream. I think I like your vid, sir. Appreciate it. Thank you. I'm I'm happy you're happy. Tack green, sure. You got it. <coughs> Whatever you say, Purpy. You're gonna hit two magenta twos into one. Oh, thank you for the gifted, man. Thank you so much. Appreciate the gifted subs. Go for gold. Yeah, obviously I'm not gonna fuck up that. We are totally cool. We totally cool. Blue has nothing. I don't think blue would be wise to put any material on Iceland. But the, the Newbery, or the magnetism of the Newbery just calls him. Yes, the magnetic Newbery of that plus two. It says, please, please give me all of your troops. Yes, give me all. Yes, I am too stupid to be given to put troops anywhere else. <laughs> the Newbery, folks. The aggressive, the aggressive, stupid. New yes, please hit me more. Hit me more. Yes, yes.
Good job. You got that plus two lockdown. You got that plus two lockdown so hard. Oh man. It's been a while since we've seen a battle for Iceland this atrocious. I figured maybe with um, alliances it could have mitigated, but but alas, it was not to be. Uh, <laughs> it was not to be. So blue has nothing on their capital and a four stack guarding out. <sighs> Green starts with nothing. Yeah. Yep. Green al almost has North Africa, though. <laughs> They're going to start spiraling out of that position. It's the purple, two. There we go, blind. Green has North Africa now. They're taking Spain. Or are they guarding? Marlon says, don't worry, I'm here. What's up, Marlon? <laughs> Hope you're doing well, sir. Hey, Blue. You watch any... uh? Risk YouTube. Don't do what you did this game. That would be dumb. <laughs> that would be dumb. Okay, me and Purple are great homies, and we're never going to fucking face each other. We're going to face opposite directions and deal with the rest of the board. <laughs> so he's getting plus three, I'm getting plus five. Red might be an asshole with that 15 cap. But it looks like red is cap stacking. So here's the situation. Green is a noob here. Blue is a noob here, even weaker. Magenta is fairly good taking Orient, which they will get next turn. Red is a cap stacker. And I believe purple and myself are the only good players in this game. That's what we're taking. Thanks to the Prime Empt. Thank you so much. The Scientist by Coldplay. I'll, I'll give that a shot. I'll definitely give Coldplay a shot. I love that song. Okay, he's going to take Denaric. No, he's going to hit Green. He's going to take um, Germany. Cool. Where do you put your troops, Blue? Put them on your four? You actually try and guard your capital at all? Buddy is not guarding his shit at all. At all. He's not guarding his shit at all. <laughs> okay. Magenta will finish Orient now. So maybe Magenta and Blue get into a little kerfuffle. It says, I made you do Viva La Vida. So that's what was next. Right on, man. I think my favorite Coldplay song is the hardest part off X and Y. I liked X and Y. I think that was my favorite Coldplay album. His, his cap is trash and he doesn't stack there either. Yeah, well, he doesn't appear to know how to play, so too bad. He, we, fought, we fought over a plus two for two turns. That was always going to be mine. <laughs> In every world, that was going to be mine. Does Green actually have Africa yet? They don't even have Africa yet. Oh, it might be time to shit in green cereal. Oh, it might be time to do that, folks. It might be time. I think the first thing I want to do is I want to deal with a bunch of this France here. Let's get some France. Lock that France down. Let's knock some people out of there. We know it's mine. Red sees it. Red loves it. I love you too, Red. Both got 13 on our cap, except now I have three bonuses. Uh, <laughs> if I can just take a bonus every turn, things will be great. Pete doesn't even have the Russia cap. What the fuck? <laughs> pocket Russia. There's no pocket Russia today, and that's why. Where is even the pocket? There's no pockets, really, this map. Pocketless. We're the pocketless Russia. 
Might as be Parachutes, but Death and All His Friends would be La Vida. Yeah, those are good tracks. How are you, Marin? How you been, buddy? Mr. Marin Bram Bam. Hey, thanks, Hudson. Thanks for the gifted. Red fails to take Russia, or he doesn't like the sitch with purple? If I was red, I would have taken Russia there for sure. Yeah, purple's now free to take Germany if he wants it. They take Denaric Alps. I like that. Mm hmm This is great. Got my round three, been an awful tourney for me. So I had a great round one, Marin. And then I got absolutely fucked. So good luck to you in round three, sir. I hope you at least have fun with your awful fixed zombie stalemates. And if you don't have fun, you know, say something. Let's get the uh, qualifying round scored at the very least so we have more, more sample size of games to play off of. Or, you know, ideally not play fixed zombies every season. I don't think it's viable for every season. Hope mine and Purple's marriage works out. I think, I hope so too, man. It's so far so good. How you doing, Scotty? Thank you for the sub, man. Okay, so now purple go, or magenta rather goes fuck you to red. That was an unfriendly play to his neighbor. Okay, green finally has North Africa. What direction would you go if you were green? You'd place an exterior. Ah, they'd place an exterior, which tells me their cap is weak. Or they're stealing Blue's cap. They're going... They're going for Blue's capital. Do we see the number flip? We do see the number flip. Blue just lost his capital. Green has no troops on it. My cheapest line down there is off of here. I could get in there slightly cheaper, I think, by breaking purple. Nobody's getting that. <laughs> That's fucking mine. <laughs> Nobody's getting that. <laughs> Red sets. Takes the four trade. How are we doing for cards? We do have one if we need them. Okay, we got Blue's Capital. We saw what Green saw. Oh! 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 Red was like, no, fuck you. Don't you break my bonus. <laughs> <laughs> holy fucking shit this is hilarious all right i hope green doesn't go retaliatory off this line but he might green going retaliatory off this line is slightly less bad i just need that other capital to keep existing okay magenta or uh, purple or other setting here Oh, maybe purple takes that green position out of existence. <laughs> no, too bad. Come on, hit it. I, w I would love it if you hit that. Hit it. One more. Hit it. 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 Yes. Ah! So I do not face retaliation from green, really, in my main position. I will get to hold that second capital. Hey, Mallory's here. How are you, Mal? What's up? What's up? Okay, Blue now getting three. They probably have quit the game. Yes, they've quit the game. Blue's a bot. I'm pretty sure those three positions are, are Blue's only three positions. We can take them. We can get the Blue Bounty. How does Green respond? Magenta's broken. Magenta probably sets, hits the red seven. Do they get to the red capital? They take the red capital. 
No, they failed to take the red capital. Okay. So now whatever green does, I might have a line to the red capital. And I get to sneakily break through orange taking a plus eight, which they very, very luckily and opportunistically grabbed. Green takes the 10 set. Maybe they feed me the blue cup. No, that's all coming into Pete. Good. That's all coming into Pete. They find Pete. They punch. No, they take Spain. Okay, so green is a land grabber. They're going to break. Yeah, they're going to take Spain. Or they're going to take Portugal. Uh, Spain, Portugal, they take France. Or they're going to guard there one point. I think I kill blue, and then I trade. Um... And I trade. All right, so I can maybe get two capitals. What's more important to get? The green cap or the red cap? I don't want both. I think I hit green hard enough to quit. This means purple gets super strong, though. Now green has nothing. Purple can be crazy strong. But so am I. <laughs> so am I. Ned very much on the ropes, breaks magenta. So green now has to reverse course, go all the way around through Italy. By the time they get to the capital, they've expended all their troops. Me going, we never going bad neighbor to purple means purple and I have totally gotten first and second. The easy, purple is going to steal red's capital here. You say purple have to deal with red magenta. I think purple can kill red here. Purple kills red right now if they wanted to. They're going to wait for an extra card maybe. Me having three capitals is great. They go very non-committal. They don't want to start any wars. Okay. Purple's a bonus player. Yeah. PD. What's up, Buck? How you doing, bud? What's up, Open? What's up, Game Solo 2? How Everyone's here tonight. How you doing? How you doing, everybody? All right, Magenta, their last hurrah. Do they continue this war of attrition where them and Red die? Soccer, Meister, love the streams and the vids. Thanks for getting me into Risk. Me and my friends love playing it, and it is so fun. Fuck yeah, man. I agree, Soccer Meister. Glad to be able to share this piece of my joy with, with all of you. I think bonuses early game is a good move. Yes. Absolutely. Addicted to my vids? Got you back into us. Fuck yeah, man. Fuck yeah, I love it. Love to hear it. Green has no bonuses. They have a 19 stack. We know what they're going to do. They're going to add their three troops to that 19. That 19 is going to go like this. And it's either going to stop at the cap or it's going to hit the cap. Either way, all I have to do on my turn is kill green. And if they don't break me, then that's even better for me. Now they go up. Yeah, break my cap there. No. Mm -hmm. Did I call this or what, folks? Dude, I called it. All right. They're going to open their line to me. 
So I'm going to have a clean, solid line to get that kill. And I have a set in case I needed it. <laughs> Thank you for your sacrifice. Just know your sacrifice will not be in vain. The troops you've com you've uh, given to the <coughs> Empire of Peatman will be very, very much appreciated and used to defeat the enemies of the Empire of Peatman. Which are numerous. I get fucked. <laughs> oh, oh! Yeah. I mean, come on, guys. Come on. Let's be, let's be real. Let's call a spade a spade. <laughs> what are you guys gonna do? What are you guys gonna do? You gonna, you gonna fucking break me now? Huh? You won't like what happens if you break me. <laughs> you won't like, like what happens if you don't. It's a tough one for pur I don't want. I wonder what purple does here, because I'm in cool with purple, and I want to go top two with purple. But purple also got to be thinking, it's like, wow, these are really scary. This is a beautiful game. Thank you. I'm enjoying this game as well. <laughs> I'm enjoying <coughs> this game as well. Ah, what would my empire's colors be? Turquoise. They would be turquoise. Moment of truth for purple. Do you choose to accept second place from me? Or, or you want to be starting something? <laughs> no, looks like he's guarding out. He's just guarding. Yep. Homie to the end. Everyone lays down their arms and says, Peatman, the game is yours. <laughs> okay, I will take the W. What am I going to get on my turn? 38 is... Um, 12... 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 33, 132, plus 6, 38, plus 30, 40, 42, 44. <laughs> 44! Ha 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 ha! 44! Ha ha ha! kill red last because he asked me to and he survived what a game well we get all the kills <laughs> we get all the kills and Robert is as always your uncle, ladies and gentlemen. Good game. 
Yeah, that was crazy. <laughs> hey, thank you, Dale Kane. Thank you, thank you. All right, we got a question. He doesn't even fucking play it out. He just bots. <laughs> hey, hey, Pete. Consider this exchange between Captain Picard and the Traveler. Thought is the basis of all reality. I can act like a lens which focuses thought. Thought is the essence of where you are now. Do you understand the danger, don't you? Picard says chaos. What we think is what happens. What level of control do you have over your thoughts? Will human beings ever be able, able to exercise total control? Oh, the question, the question for me is, yes, I got it. Uh, the question for me is, what level of control do you have over your thoughts? Will human beings ever be able to exercise total control? So we have zero control over our thoughts from a perspective, right? Um, it's important to remember, I don't know why I keep hitting the, the Windows button. Um, it's important to remember that you don't create your thoughts, right? Like your, your experience of your own thought creation is such that um, thoughts just arise randomly, right? They don't really appear to exist via some sort of intentional process that you are responsible for. Um, and this is a very important thing to bear witness to because we tend to self-identify as our mind, which it absolutely is not, right? You have to remember that your mind is a tool and the only thing that the mind does is solve problems. So as a tool that solves problems, if you want to be solving problems all the time, then great, let your mind run free. But if you have no control over your mind, if you have no control over this tool, you don't know how to turn it off. That's what meditation is for. So as far as having the ability to control your thoughts, um, I don't think we want really, I don't think we want to or need to control our thoughts. I think the slight reframe I would go with your question is we would want control over our mind. Different. You see what I'm saying? The mind is um, where thoughts are created, but you your spirit or your soul or whatever word you want to use to describe who you are, the being, the sentient, radiant form of life that is listening to my words right now that I am communicating with through ma the magic of technology. Um, you are not your thoughts. You are not your mind, right? You are the thing that observes them. And that's very important to distinguish between. So no, I don't think we'll ever have control over our thoughts because I don't think we would want to. You're, except for Boosted. Boosted is not radiant. He's covered in shit, as a matter of fact. <laughs> How you doing, Captain Taint Tickler? What's this? 70%? We take it. What a fucking game. <laughs> <coughs> You know, a bunch of noobs doing a bunch of new different types of noob stuff. And because I had the vi the perfect vision and the perfect alliance in purple, right? Never broke me. So there you have it, folks. Hope you enjoyed that one. Uh, defeating a bunch of noobs. Yep. Novices and four beginners, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you enjoyed. And until next time, for all of you on the path to world domination, good games and good luck.